Alrighty. Good morning. This is the love reading for Saturday. June 15th. 2024. Let's see what will happen. Let's see. Comment, like, share and do subscribe. Okay. Mental clarity. Whatever you're thinking about this very second, whatever is going on, you will be very clear about your perception, your feelings, but also you will get clarification no how your person feels about you by some miracle we can see magi looks like magician having a crystal ball we can see a man good looking man you know what also I think you know this man is reading your mind Okay, let's go in depth, you know, let's see what this is all about. Both of you are wise people, whether you are men or women, you know, both of you are very wise people. So let's see what this is. Three of Swords, what the heck, Three of Swords, heartache. Okay, if nothing else, because this is a breakup, you know. If nothing else, you know, you will, you will come to understanding, you know. Do you want to stay? Do you want to go? Maybe you want to quit saying, dating, you know, this person. Maybe both of you will come to some understanding. We should talk. We should do something about it, right? Because it's a breakup. A breakup. Three of swords. It's a breakup, but... Tarot cards, you know, in this deck are so lovely, so beautiful. So, honey, this could be end of dispute, but also could be completely new breakup. Um, maybe you're already apart. Maybe you're getting, you know, apart. This is the sign of divorce. Okay, people, for better or for worse, you know, at least you will know where you stand. And how this person feels for you. For some of you, today you just might understand this person maybe is completely wrong for you. You know, Three of Swords also is wrong choice, you know, um, wrong person. Four of Swords, okay, this is so interesting, you know, Three of Swords, Four of Swords. So this situation is calming down. This could be a big fight. Look at this. Three of Swords, Four of Swords. You know what? Some of you feel so good being alone. You know, this looks like a fresh breakup to me. Fresh breakup. And you know, just around the corner... You'll say to yourself, like, you know, what the heck, you know, I don't want to fix, you know, this. I can't do it. I'm so done. So when everything is said and done, when you don't feel you should fix this situation, this marriage, this person, you know, whatever. So you are giving up. You are giving up. So see, guys, you know, mental clarity. In this reading, I think you will give up on someone. Will this person beg you, don't give up on me? I'm not that bad, you know. Don't give up on me, you know. I'll change. I'll change because of you. I'll change in the name of love, you know, whatever. People, could be this, could be that. Now... I see a lot of you pissed off. Like, what the heck? I will never fall in love again. Ever, never, ever, never, you know? But around the corner, as usual, probably something new is waiting on you. 
Oh honey, you are interested more in money than in love. I can predict a lot of money. This could be money coming to you after divorce. Could be your career. Could be your gain of some sort. But since I just talked about heartache and dispute and problems and divorce, this also could be money that you might get after your divorce. Even though if you're still single, then maybe this is not your so your story, you know, at all. So I think a lot of you are pissed off, you know, on someone. You can be angry at yourself. Like what the heck? Again? The same old story. Again, this time you won't accept truth it looks like you are done okay honey someone new and soon will start knocking at your doors this is actually ideal time to start seeing someone new because it's written on this card new love is coming I think this is what you need after this breakup. You see, breaking up. Three of swords. You know, for some of you this also means maybe you need to travel. Maybe you want to change your neighborhood. Maybe you are leaving your family because you just have enough, you know. Whatever people are not could be this, you know, could be that. Also, I won't lie to you. For some of you, I see person coming back, coming back. I see someone even offering you money, especially if you're a woman. So this man might offer you a bunch of money. Let's try it. Let's, let's try it again. Queen of Pentacles don't need <clears throat> other people money. <clears throat> Queen of Pentacles. This is general they love the reading. So for every single woman, you know, for the day you are described as very independent woman, smart, intelligent. You don't like people patronizing you. Okay? So Queen of Pentacles, like I want to be on my own. You have your dog, you have your cat. And you don't you don't want to mess around with you know other people with this person uh, if they're not perfect for you. So what you want, you know what you want. You don't want anything less than perfect. This is actually what I see. So it's not like milk and honey, but sometimes we need to confront with the facts, this person stink, metaphorically speaking, you know. So, I mean, I, I know it looks like, you know, you are leaving your household, you know, becoming very, very independent this time. Also, could be Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, I say Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, could be someone completely new. There you go. I didn't expect it, this, but actually, you know what I see? I see Queen of Pentacles, <clears throat> excuse me, and Knight of Pentacles, which means perfect match. I see older women, I see younger men. You know what? After divorce, in which you gave everything possible, you know, you really, really tried, you know, to do your best. But now I see you giving up, you know, the moment you give up. Maybe you already gave up, you know, from your marriage. Maybe you are already divorced or simply single. Now I see person perfect for you. I see younger man, a bit older woman. I see him giving you a lot of compliments. Uh, it's a very generous young man. Completely different than your ex. So, this is unexpected choice both for you and for this person but 
you don't have anything you know against this time I see you you can breathe more easily no thinking you know in the box now you think more about yourself than about your partner uh, in a sense like I don't see you now indulging partner you know that much like saying what the heck like let me let me enjoy I see you enjoying as a woman with a younger man could be but doesn't have to be Capricorn Virgo Taurus a Libra Gemini Aquarius I'm totally into you you know this love statement is a type of a statement that you ever never expected I'm totally into you I like you as a man I like you as a woman you know so this is nice you know what this is a new chance better chance if you will you have life experience you are more stronger and now you want to enjoy let me be your hero let me be your hero when a man says something of that kind and it means he is totally into you you see new cycle new love so much more better and so much more <clears throat> friendly if you will you know honey it's time for you to start enjoying yourself no matter what And this is our story for Saturday. See you soon again. God bless. Beautiful music, right? Good luck. Good luck. Bye bye.